If your experience on commercial airliners is one of cramped aisles and small video displays, then the Aircraft Interiors Expo will broaden your horizons when it comes to the future of air travel. From luxury seating pods to connections for your iPod, every type of in-flight luxury was on display. Uh, we're looking forward to an, IP, an IP-enabled aircraft, whereby instead of having a, um, a, a, a mini Pico cell site on the aircraft, we're going to be looking at, uh, at hotspot coverage and voice over IP. In-flight connectivity is one thing when it comes to luxury travel, but comfort is key, especially if you've got the bucks to pay for it. What we see happening in the marketplace today is that you have very long flights, 12, 13, 14, 15 hours, and um, when you have those type of flights, and many times those flights are being, people flying them are, are, are going for business purposes, um, they want to be able to get a good night's sleep and work in privacy, and, um, and then there's also just wealthy individuals who have very high expectations. Airbus also was on hand showing off the 800 passenger A380 as well as a redesigned interior for the A350. The extra wide body firstly gives you more cabin width, um, a straighter side wall, the side of the cabin is straighter which means the passenger has more space around the head and around the head and the shoulder. So if air travel is on your horizon and money is no object you could be sitting in the lap of luxury on your next flight. John Belmont, the Associated Press.